Alrighty, so for the last boss here, we're going to go to uh, uh, the Bomber Kuwanger. Is that his name? Boomer Kuwanger. Okay, Boomer. Be very careful with the spiky ball chain guys. Um, so when you get up to this laser part, it's good to use the charged up sting chameleon weapon. Uh, it makes you temporarily invulnerable for a time. But you dash through. Things uh, take more than one shot to die with the rolling shield, uh, and you got the charge version here, they'll take it away. But I could have sworn those guys took more than one shot off the shield. Huh. Maybe I'm remembering a different version, or they changed something up. Alright, so you see the heart tank uh, up there to the right? The way to do it? not hit that menu. Uh, we want to use a charged up uh, ice uh, shot to create a little platform for us to jump off of. There we go. Right. So yes, I now have all the heart tanks, but I am still neglecting the last sub-tank, which you need the boomerang weapon for. Let's see. So, uh, Bomber Kuwanger takes a homing missile, um, which makes the boss fight sound a lot easier than it actually is. But you'll see it here. So yeah, he flashes around, you always want to make sure you've got a couple of shots on the screen. Make sure that you're dashing off the wall away from him, and all that happy things. But yeah, just keep away. That's the best strategy.
Ah, right. Cutscene with Zero. Letting him know that we've found Sigma. Well, yes. We shall go find Sigma. But first, we need to get the sub-tank and spark mandrel stage. There. Switch the boomerang up and right time to jump up in the air and hit it on your way down. There you go. So yeah, all the weapons, all the sub tanks, all the heart tanks. Now all that remains before Sigma is the Hadouken. 